Team 4 now, and Marissa is joining us. Marissa, there's some pretty significant fog in some spots out there right now. Yeah, you just saw it there. That was a look of our scene before we went into break. And before that, we had a lot of clear skies, a lot of sunshine, so we are seeing some fog. It is mainly focused towards the lakefront, though, and especially out over Lake Michigan. While most spots inland, we are looking at a day full of sunshine and also some very warm temperatures. A great day to go to the pool today. We will have temperatures into the upper 80s, near 90 degrees this afternoon. It is going to be another hot day across southeast Wisconsin. A live look over Waukesha. You can see just a couple of clouds out there, but 82 already, and temperatures will continue to climb. We do have 80s in most spots Inland, one of our warmest spots, uh, Watertown, excuse me, right now at 87 degrees. Closer to the lake where we not only have some fog, we also have a wind out of the northeast that's bringing in some of the slightly cooler air. So we're in the 70s at this hour, and I actually expect temperatures to not really move much farther as we move into this afternoon. High pressures in full control. That's keeping us dry today. We have had a couple of showers and thunderstorms pop up each and every day over the last few days. That's not going to happen today, though, because of high pressure and also due to the fact that the storm system that brought some of that energy in is now a little farther off to the southeast. So today we'll keep it mostly sunny, especially farther from the lake. The lake, though, we will be dealing with some patchy fog at times, and you can see it here on your future forecast as we move closer to about 4 o'clock. As you're driving home, a lot of sunshine farther inland, though towards the lake we still have that layer of fog. And then as we move into this evening, still also looking at that push of fog towards the lakefront. Looks like we're going to see some showers, but they fizzle out before they get here. So mostly clear skies expected as we even move into this evening. Evening. Temperatures quite split across the area today, closer to the lake, highs in the mid to upper 70s, but farther from the lake, high temperatures will be in the upper 80s, pushing 90 degrees. So another hot day, another humid day across the area as well, kind of sticky out there. This trend will continue over the next few days, the split between temperatures towards the lakefront and inland. Low 80s expected Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Inland, though, we will continue to see temperatures pushing 90 degrees each and every day. If you're wondering, well, are we going to see any rain? My lawn's starting to turn brown. My plants are getting sad. Well, our next chance won't be until Friday. And with that, it's just going to be a slight chance for showers late Friday into early Saturday. But mostly the next seven days are looking pretty dry and very sunny, especially as we move into next week. All right, Marissa, thank you. And calling all artists, your child's creativity could be featured on the Storm Team 4's color the forecast. You can download this coloring page on tmj4.com slash color forecast. That's the number four. Now let your child do the coloring. Then you just submit this online. Then you can watch TMJ4 News today and TMJ4 News at six to see their artwork. We'll be right back.